When we look at this kind of midway check-in, we've seen a lot of great improvement since we all started last August, and I'm just really proud of where we've gotten. Tessa Sinclair and the Tri-County Soldiers Jewel team have reached the midway point of the season, and the group is hoping for a solid second half. Sinclair is one of the leaders of veteran players on the Soldiers roster. We've definitely seen a lot of strides just as a team, um, looking at individual players, definitely making great strides in their skill sets, but then also working as a team and kind of meshing as you through the season. So our word of the season so far has been dictate. So dictate defensively and then kind of how we translate that into offense. And I think we've been really successful in kind of just finding that next gear. And I think as we move through the months, one thing about the jewel season is it flies by. So as we kind of move through getting into, you know, week six, week seven, uh, we're really kind of putting everything together. With this group, we are uh, a do it by committee group. So we have uh, one through really 13, 14, 15, including the coaches um, that contribute in, in many different ways. And with everybody, the minutes are, are spread pretty evenly right now and everybody's stepping on court and, and playing their role well and building and growing in that role. And so I think we continue to do that with depth as this, as this season rolls along, we continue to beat teams with depth. The Jewel Prep Squad is also working hard to climb up the standings in the second half of the season. Addison Stoner says she loves the team chemistry and high energy with this year's group. I feel like we've really come together as a team through all the ups and downs of our games. We always end up just staying together and being positive and I feel like we're just always building each other up and I feel like we've become friends more than teammates and I feel like we're also very good defensively because we're a quick team. We're not necessarily very tall but we use our speed to our advantage. The soldiers return to action this coming Sunday at Woodland Christian High School. The Jewel game tips off at 1030. The Jewel prep squad hits the floor at 1230. Both games will be played against the London Ramblers.